So what's up guys? Welcome to Rafa's Garage. Today I'm working on these actually this line. Um, basically when I turned it on I had a leak over there by where I dig a hole and that line goes to I believe my sprinklers so I opened it up and it's leaking from right here and when I was digging this up I cut this line and I think this line is for my automatic or uh, sprinklers control where I can control it from um, basically the one that's over there um, so I'm gonna go to Home Depot real quick and basically buy a new sprinkler and a T hopefully these lines are good uh, there's one that goes over here to another sprinkler right there where the corners at and then it also makes a T right here dug up to here and it, it, there should be another one right here so hopefully those are still good if not I got a big project on my hand I gotta dig up all this up and see if anything else is broken um, so let's go to Home Depot real quick buy what I need and come back so we're gonna cut right here and right here um, and then put this T on it and the sprinkler that I have right here so I think I might need another coupling. measured everything this is gonna go here this is here so he's good to test fit it and then this T is gonna go right here so I'm all done just gotta clean it up and then add so this is a purple primer and this is the cement make sure everything's clean um, before you put it on you're gonna put some in here around there and then that's about it um it has a little brush already on it you'll see right now but let's get to it uh, let's put them on and see if it works <laughs> pop is already in um, now nah, just to put the sprinkler um, we are gonna use Teflon tape on it I have it right here so we're gonna use this and then also a little connector for it which is this one right here that goes in here and it screws in here so I'm gonna do that right now test it out let's see if I have any more leaks uh, let's see if that one works and then the one over here I might have a leak over there uh, but I'll try it out once this is dry I think it takes about like 30 minutes to dry um, allow 15 minutes for good handling strength two hours cure time at temperatures above six Everything's there, needs to dry up. The way you tell, I think this one's a uh, 180, so it's gonna just throw all this water right here. The way you tell is this right here. I also bought a 90 degree, and right here you'll see it. This little one is 90, this one's 180, so that's where it's gonna throw the air, the water. If anything, I could still twist it a little bit or adjust it. Um, you could adjust it with the little screwdriver, so. Um, 
let it dry two hours i'll pick it up when i when it's dry and then give it a test and if anything i have extra fittings um just in case somewhere else is broken i believe it's gonna be broken over there that's why i have the 90 degree one over there for that corner so it could hit this way but i'll pick it up as soon as um i'm done here Right now I need to cut the yard so I'm gonna do that real quick before so moment of truth seeing if I have another leak this is actually my valve to turn it on guess they do work oh shit there was another sprinkler right there but I guess I put two I didn't even see that one right there that one probably needs to get replaced another leak right here so I'm gonna start digging right here somewhere right here it broke probably the pipe that goes from there all the way down here so let's check it out so there is my leak right there this one right here so I'm gonna dig it up a little bit more and see where it goes. Maybe plug it up or maybe just put another one right here. Probably take that one over here, the one that I had here, and put it over here. put this 90 degree one on just to make sure that I got no more breakage I'm probably gonna return this one and then just put that one over here the 180 and then plug that one up since there's there's already one over there so let me run it real quick and see if it works There it is. I think I might have to set one over here also because it doesn't grab it all the way. That one's been putting in work. Let me see if it goes a whole 360. No, it doesn't go a full 360. That one only does a 180, 180 right here, and that one's probably just a 90. So, I don't know, I might plug both of them up. <clears throat> I might plug up that one, plug up this one. Oh, already got the plugs gotta put them on and then probably adjust the sprinklers right now and hopefully see what I need if I need another ones in the back probably I'm gonna need one in the side over there so and then that one I'm probably gonna make it a three fit a 360 uh, I see that you could adjust them so that's what I'm gonna do real quick So there it is I just gotta adjust that one and this one right here because 
that one's throwing it too far out and I wanted to throw it more over there so see how I adjust it right now so I was able to get that one for a 360 but I think I'm gonna change it to a 180 just have a 180 here and that one 180 here and this one I might take it off right here so I'm gonna take that one off and put it in that corner so I'm gonna dig a hole right there so I could take it off and then start digging here all the way through um, there's a pipe here so maybe I could run into this pipe somewhere and maybe use this pipe that's right here but yeah let's get to it dug the trench I did measurements from all the way over there so tomorrow I'll clean it up and then go to Home Depot and go buy the missing pipe that I need and the fittings so I'm probably gonna need a 30 degree angle here another 30 degree angle over there then another plug for that for that sprinkler or maybe not because I could probably use this one I'll probably have a I'll probably use that one since I'm not gonna need a plug. I'm just gonna extend that one. And that's it. I'll pick it up tomorrow. Uh, right now I'm probably gonna put these roses that I bought from Home Depot. That one was 25. These were two for ten. So yeah. I'm probably gonna put them in the front. So I'll probably do that right now. So I already bought the stuff I needed from Home Depot. Time to get this started and move that sprinkler over there real quick and seal this one real quick. Should be fairly so there it is working perfectly fine that one's able to do this one this one does this halfway this one does this other 180 right here so that's it i'm just gonna cover up the hole and call it a day Covered it up, try to level it, step on it. Might need a little bit more dirt, but I'll do that later. But that's it. Thanks for watching. I'm out.